Hey, what's up, everyone? Um, Anadi Lama here. So I, or I took two of the three games from that last series against Colorado. So um, final series is against San Francisco. I lost the first game. We won the second game. So here I'm going to check out the standings. Um, I'm two games back, so there's really no way I can make the postseason, which really sucks. Um, especially since there's two wild cards this year, but the game didn't have it. So uh, yeah, I will miss the postseason, which is really annoying because <laughs> I played a lot of games and we won a lot of the ones I won, but. At the end, I just got kind of bored of playing, so I simulated, like, the last, like, two or three months, and we didn't make it, so, um, I'll do another season with the Dodgers. I'm not gonna play any games, though, unless we get to the postseason. I'll probably just, uh, right now, I gotta, like, uh, re-sign all my guys and stuff here in the offseason. Here you can see, uh, all the awards that everyone won, uh, MVP and stuff like that, Cy Young, but I'm just gonna re-sign all my guys. I'll simulate up until, uh... Probably the All-Star game, put some guys up on the trade block and then see if I can get any trades, and then I'll simulate to, uh, to the end of the season, and if I get in the playoffs, I'll play that, because, uh, I don't know, I'll probably do that. Um, if I get in the playoffs, like I said, I'll play that, and if not, um, I don't know, I might do another season with the Dodgers doing the same thing, just simulating the season, see if I can get in, and if I don't, I think I'm going to do a new franchise. Um, I was thinking I was going to use the Nationals, because I wanted to use them before the Dodgers, but... Uh, I don't know, I chose the Dodgers for some reason, I think it was because they had a bigger budget and stuff, but yeah, you can see I got a lot of guys to sign here, I got to sign uh, Clayton Kershaw, which uh, I think he wanted like 20 million bucks a year, 22 million bucks a year, I put up a little bit less than that, so I think he accepts it here, which is kind of nice, but that he's going to kill my team there, 21.8 million dollars a year, and then D. Gordon, I think he was making like league minimum he wants nine million a year there so yeah, it'll hurt my salary a lot having to give these uh big guys a lot of money but um yeah like i said i'll simulate the next season um i think i'm gonna use the nationals i'm gonna probably put up some road to the show videos too i haven't played that game mode in forever but uh i don't know i think uh i like playing it and stuff when i do play i just gotta get back into it so um i don't know yeah um oh, i saw another thing i'll put a uh, link to this in the uh, info if anyone wants to check it out it was a pretty interesting story i guess kurt schilling uh Former Red Sox pitcher, and I think he played for uh, Arizona, too. He won a World Series there, but he opened up a video game studio, uh, 38 Studios, and uh, he just put out this game, uh, Kingdoms of Amalar, which I think it was a mix between, like, Skyrim and Tekken, stuff like that. It was a role-playing game, so I never played it or not, so I don't know if it's any good or anything like that, but um, I saw he just uh, fired his entire staff because he had to take out a uh, $100 million loan from, uh, I think it was the state of Rhode Island or Massachusetts, one of them, but he had to take that out and he had to pay him back like a million and a half bucks a month to pay it off, and he couldn't do that, so he had to lay his entire staff off of 500 people, I think it said, and he did it by email, which is, uh, I don't know, I think it's like a really douchey way to do, because these are all like high, uh, high level position guys, and uh, he just sent him an email saying they were temporary fire, temporarily fired until uh, he can find a fix for this, and I think they said his studio is likely going to go bankrupt, so... I'll put a, uh, a link in the uh, info down below so people, you guys can uh, check that out if you want. I thought it was kind of interesting. It's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of like douchey of him to do it like that, to not like call people and stuff like that. I don't know you can't call every employee, but he probably should have called uh, the top level guys and stuff like that. And they said they were working on a game which would be similar to Diablo, but they do uh, postpone it since they went bankrupt. But that would be pretty interesting to see if he did a game like Diablo because, um, like I said, I never played his game, but I wanted to check it out. Maybe if it's a GameStop next time I go, I'll buy it or something, because uh, I'm not really into like, role-playing games, but I did like Skyrim. That game was pretty fun. I never beat it, but something different to play, because uh, I used to play Call of Duty all the time, and I'm like, I don't know, Black Ops wasn't that good. Modern Warfare 3 was kind of dumb, so uh, i just been playing this game lately, and there's really nothing else to play, so um, I don't know. I might pick up that game. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, I was just looking at... Um, free agents and stuff here, seeing if I could uh, sign somebody here. I sign, uh, or I try to sign Kevin Correa here. I submit him a deal. Uh, I submitted one to uh, Robinson Cano, but I think he ends up rejecting it, so um, I'm not sure if he did it already or not, but yeah, he rejects it there, which is probably a good thing, because I don't think I would have had the money to sign him, and if I did, I would have had to uh, probably lose a lot of players. So um, yeah, here I offer uh, this guy Travis Hafner a, uh, a contract, because my first baseman really wasn't that good. I didn't want to re-sign... Uh, I think James Loney wanted too much money, so I didn't want to go after him and re-sign him. So there's that, and then I offer Brandon Inge a deal here since uh, I didn't have a uh, third baseman at all. I think the guy I had was a minor league guy who uh, was only like 19 or 20 in this game, so I don't want to bring him up yet. I don't think he's probably ready. So uh, I think let me see how much time is left in this video because <laughs> I got like nothing else to talk about here. Um, all right, so the video is going to end in like 10 seconds. All right, that was good timing. So uh, 
yeah, like I said, I'll just do another video where I just like simulate most of the season of videos. It'll just be the trade deadline and the postseason if I get in. So uh, I right, that's it, guys. Uh, bye.